Later on in the night When the crowds have gone We could talk under moonlight Till dawn Back from the moment I set eyes on you, I felt connected to you and felt this enduring love for you. And I feel such gratitude for you for, for being with me. Uh, when I first met Kyle, little did I know that our paths would intertwine so profoundly. It makes me happy to see him happy with Rhiannon and, and finally finding somebody to just be his partner in life. I have never felt like it takes more than two or three seconds for us to be like, I haven't talked to you in three years. Let's catch up. Okay, cool. We're right back where we are. That's an amazing friend. That's a best friend. There's a lot of awards that Rihanna could win. Award for most identifiable laugh. Makes you feel like the funniest person ever alive. Award, Rhiannon is a very unique individual. This girl just lights up the room as we know. When Rhiannon told me that she was dating Kyle, she was like, he's a teacher at Nisqually. It's like, mm. and then I met Kyle and he's so great. And I was like, I'm down, I'm in this. And every time we talked, we would always talk about her first. It was always about Rhiannon. It was always, you know, I want you to meet her, I want you to meet her, she's going to be my wife one day. The first time I heard about Rhiannon was Kyle called me and he'd asked out this girl and she has the best laugh. And I'm like, oh man, he's smitten. This boy's really smitten. A few weeks, a couple months later, I hear, we woke up this morning and we did quadratic equations just for fun. It was so hot. <laughs> Rhiannon, I've only had a couple thoughts for you my entire life. One, find peace, find a career that you love, and two, find somebody that makes you feel like a queen every day. And you've got that in Kyle. We can see the greatest accomplishment anyone can do, and that's finding a partner who pushes you in so many ways, the same rigor in those pursuits that you guys are both looking for. Raise a glass to love, laughter, and happily ever after. Cheers, guys. Hello and welcome to this special day. We gather on this joyful occasion to celebrate the love between these two lovely people, Rhiannon and Kyle. milestone on your journey through life. As of today and every day after, you will have each other to lean on as you walk down this path together. Kyle and Rhiannon, please look into each other's eyes now as you share your vows for one another. I knew from the moment you let your hair down at the gym, this girl was wife material. <laughs> I had the strongest urge to get to know her better. Luckily, I had an in with my buddy Jason. As soon as I could get your name, I quickly, after that, smoothly inquired about your relationship status. Everything about our first interaction was so easy. Little did I know that you had already had, my, already had your eye on me uh, on Tinder. <laughs> our first dates were fantastic. I couldn't wait to see you again, and I did. Over and over again, we spent time together, and I couldn't help thinking how perfect this girl was. We've been through so much, moving in together, a pandemic, school, and while I've discovered that you might not be perfect in every way, I know I want to do this with you. You are my partner, my person. You're all I ever think about. You are the most important person in my life. I vow to be your partner too. To share this life equally with you, to bring you flowers for no reason, 
to care for you when you were sick, unless I have Nora at the same time. <laughs> To take you on vacations, to celebrate your triumphs and joys as if they were my own, to be a good roommate, to be your best friend. I look forward to falling in love with you over and over again. Who knew how my life would change that day you asked me out, loud enough for the entire gym to hear. <laughs> Soon after our first date, we never wanted to be apart, and I wished you were near all the time. I even missed you during my quick trips to the grocery store. I thought that perhaps during the stay home orders, we would finally get sick of each other. But no, we somehow managed to find even more things to do together. We started unloading the dishwasher together and even mowing the lawn together so that the walls of the house wouldn't have to be between us. An inseparable love like this is one I've never imagined but it has made me the happiest, most confident, and most comfortable I've ever been. To this day, I can't get enough of you. As we embark on this new chapter, I will take time to go down memory lane with you, savoring the nostalgia of our early days and revisiting the things that brought us together. I will also look to our future and always strive for an even better us. I will work towards making those tough conversations not so tough. I will take care of you when you are sick or sad, share in your celebrations, and revel in those times you feel joyful just because. I vow to always be your best friend and work to be the partner that you need. These vows I see not as promises, but as privileges. I get to laugh with you and cry with you. I get to grow old with you, confide in you, listen to you, trust you, and be trusted by you. You are my person, the love of my life, the one I get to fall for over and over again. For that, I will be your faithful partner in life and live in gratitude for you daily. This ring is a token of my love for you. Let it remind you that you are always in my heart. This ring is a token of my love for you. Let it remind you that you are always in my heart. Kyle, do you welcome Rhiannon to be your wife and your cherished best friend? I do. Rhiannon, do you welcome Kyle to be your husband and your cherished best friend? I do. Rhiannon and Kyle, please seal your marriage with a kiss. Oh, sorry, wait. It is my delight and honor to pronounce you as married. You may now seal your kiss with a kiss. Nope. <laughs> <laughs>
at the gym. He sees her, they're kind of having a little back and forth over a few days. And he sees her this one day, he feels the green light, he's ready to go. And he says, yo, can I hit on you? All right, we're gonna do it one time as a group. All right, ready? I'm gonna be Kyle. Yo!